As an artistic director, I try to make a selection of a season of plays based on a single idea or, or theme. This year is the 200th anniversary of the history of the town. For us, that's a joyous event, and there was no better way to celebrate that than by focusing on a kind of theater, a theater of celebration, a theater that lifts our spirits. And so I chose for this season, a season of comedy. Our first play is by Neil Simon, a classic American author. It's called The Last of the Red Hot Lovers. And I've looked forward to doing this play all my life, since I saw it when I was a young man. Three minutes, I'll dazzle you. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get shorter? Shorter since yesterday? Why do you look short? I can't imagine why I look shorter. Oh, flat. Flat? <laughs> the play actually concerns the life of a man named Barney Cashman, who has a bad idea. And the idea is that if the world around him is participating in all kinds of cheating and infidelity. Even better, did you get, did you get shorter? Yeah, I'm gonna turn you around. Did you get shorter? <laughs> I love it. Okay. He ought to grab that ring as it goes by, and just along with everybody else. Um, He's not very good at grabbing that ring. No, that's the right address. Well, I should hope so. <laughs> Otherwise, where am I and who are you? <laughs> He's really not cut out for that kind of life. And what we see is a very, very humorous series of encounters that demonstrate to Barney that maybe infidelity isn't such a great idea after all. I am looking forward to doing this play and bringing it to New Harmony so much because I have one of the best casts I have ever assembled. These four actors have such comic gifts that I think they'll have the audience rolling in the aisles. Can we go back a little? What's the four? I, I already make out with the broad the first act. I don't need to make out with you two. And my wife is in the third act. Come on. Um, what do I... <laughs>